everybody it's your girl sincerely Dre, and i'm back today with another video about the time down below i will be showing you guys what's in my college book bag i just literally came from classes so everything in here is what like i just brought into the room so i'm gonna show you guys what's in here usually my book bag is always full with stuff the only thing that probably changes about what's in my book bag is depending on the day and what classes i have the binder might change or there may be like an extra notebook in there for like the certain class so we're just gonna get right into it I have a regular black book bag, Adidas black book bag that I use from when I played basketball in high school. I didn't buy a new book bag for college because I mean like, why would I go out and spend more money when this bag works perfectly fine? So this is my little roll doll book bag. I like it because it has different organized, like it has different sections for everything. If you know me, I'm really organized, I like everything to be in a certain place. So this works because it has a space for everything. So we're just gonna start from the top. Here's a little thing that like, you know, you hook your bag on to. I know the name tag says Davidson. I went to a tour at Davidson, so that's why I have it. And I haven't taken it off, even though I go to UGA, I haven't taken it off just because like, it has all my information on here. If my bag was to get stolen, you know how to like, contact the person and figure out whose bag it is. So, and it's a good identifier, even though this is an identifier because there's not that many people from this school with this there's not that many people who went to this school with this book bag here so you know just something for my bag to stand out so i know my bag out of like plenty so that's that um so you have your two little pocket holders on the side in this side i have a little ziploc bag and i have note cards in here so if i ever need to write anything down i can put it on here I'm currently taking a speech class as well, so these are very important having note cards so I can write down my speeches and my main points and all of that on here. And then like if my teacher ever says like a quick note that you might need to know for the test or something, I put it on here so like I can look at that at a later time. The other thing I have in this section is post-it notes, so this goes for the same thing if my teacher's like, okay, make sure you remember that for the test, I can write, okay, remember this and put it on like the exact part of my notes that I write. So just two different things right here. I'm actually running low on both of these, so I gotta read up, but I got those in my desk. Um, the next thing on this side, this side I keep my charger in. So I have a nice short charger for when I'm out. I don't need a long charger when I'm out, just something quick and short. I love this, it charges my phone really fast. <laughs> So that and then my mouse my laptop is cool and all but like you know I don't know if it's just me but I'm like when I'm on my laptop I'm always like clicking having to move to different things and like my my hand gets tired after a certain point so I just like to use the mouse so it's like easier for me to get from the different points so I have a mouse for my laptop here and my charger that's that now to the first zipper at the let's yeah the first zipper at the top that's what we're gonna do so you open this part up i'll put this over here but you open this part up and there's like a whole lot of stuff in here so in the main section i have my water bottle i only like water i only drink water if you know me you probably won't ever see me drinking anything else you might see me have like a smoothie or something but i love water and i don't like water fountains though but here on campus there are certain water fountains that are filtered so i like to like be supplied with my water in the morning because in my classes like the buildings that my classes are in are older buildings so they don't have the filtered water so i have this so i could just drink water whenever i need to so that's that. This over here actually. Um, and I have a little Tupperware, a little container. Um, if you know anything about UGA or anything about college, you know that the meal plan costs a lot. I have 
the most expensive meal plan right now i have seven days a week all access with extra points on it so like you could go to different places to eat and like I mean, that's cool and all, but the only thing that's wrong is that our dining halls on campus close at 9. I don't usually like to eat until all my work is done. And I don't usually like to eat until later in the day. So 9 is a little bit too early for me. So I eat this even though I'm eating differently now, so I don't really eat dinner all the time. But I keep this with me just in case like they have any really like, in case they have like any grapes or something that I want or anything, I'll put it in here so I can bring it back to the room or just take it from place to place because I pay a lot of money for that meal plan so I'm getting all my money worth of that meal plan. So yeah, I keep this with me so I can like stock up and take things from place to place. So that's that. Um, the next thing is my eyeglass container. I have two of my shades in here right now. The, the shades that I wear all the time are sitting over there on my desk because I wear them all the time. These are my extra ones just in case. I have my pink ones and some more like holographic key looking ones. I always have shades on me because if you know me, you know I'm always wearing shades because like my eyes are really sensitive. Really, I'm, I'm not gonna say they're sensitive, but I squint a lot when it's sunny outside to see. And the more I squint, my head will start to hurt. And I don't like when my head hurts because my head does my head doesn't usually hurt, you know. So I wear shades in order to stop all that from happening. Next thing is my wallet, of course, because you know how are you gonna go out and get anything? So I have my wallet with me. Usual wallet stuff is in my wallet. Um then I have my lotion because you always need lotion all the time. You know, for me personally, I don't know if other people do this as well, I think. But like when you wash your hands, it tends to get ashy after and I don't like being ashy. So I have my lotion for that reason. And a lot of people usually ask me for lotion. So I always keep lotion on me. So that's that. Then I have this extra little bag in my bag. This, there's nothing special in here. It's just like, I keep hand sanitizer because like I said, I like to be clean. So I keep my hand sanitizer here. Carmex, I don't really use Carmex, but just in case. Some extra perfume, a small little thing of lotion. Some gum, just like any regular small looking things. I keep this in this bag because it's easy to just take all the essentials right here and when I switch bags, I can just take it like this instead of having to pick out every single thing. So yeah. And then I have my portable charger this portable charger is my baby it always charges my phone up a lot and it charges it ch this charges really quick it charges my phone really quick and it has multiple charges in it so it lasts a long time so i love this thing i got it from target just the wireless the biggest one possible so yeah uh and then i have my binder this binder nothing special about it just you know schoolwork in here so yeah and then i have my laptop that sits in the back just in case i need to do any work my laptop is here so yeah that's what i have in the main section of my book bag and now let's get into the other sections of the book bag so in this part right here it's just like pens and pencils and stuff i keep a lot of pens and pencils like if you were with me in high school you would know my notes are always color coded i can't look at i don't like looking at written notes that are like all in black like it's cool and all but everything being in like a different color really sparks my attention to that so if you want me to do a video on like how i do my notes how i organize my notes let me know now do that nothing special just i use different colors so each class has a different color so I can remember like different things like that. Each class has its own color. And then of course I use black as well. So just highlighters, Ooh. highlighters, pencils, pens, all that good stuff. Each class has its own color so everything's organized. I keep a hair tie because I always need a hair tie. People are always asking for hair tie. So I keep it just in case I forget it. I have a hair tie in the bag. Um, then I keep some band-aids because if I get cut or something, I don't like, like, I don't like having like little small baby cuts just out. 
like even if I have a little paper cut, I will want to cover it up with a band-aid. So I always keep band-aids on me. I don't know, that's just me. And I keep an extra little eraser because it's like if you don't know nothing about these erasers, these erasers like erase real clean. So that's why I use this one. And that's all that's in this section. Let me put all this back. <laughs> Then in this section there are little there are two parts and if you open up this part this is like a little small area so I don't keep much in here it's just a thing of gum if I ever need it and that's about it and then in this section when I was in high school I used to love this section because I mean now I have insulated bottles and all of that but before I didn't I just had regular water bottles that I'll bring from the house that would be cold but like throughout the day it would get warm I love this section because this section if you can't see it's like that thing that you leave like the thing that you have in lunch bags and stuff to keep your stuff cold or keep yourself really hot so I really like this section even though I don't use it for that anymore but this part has more storage in it I keep the little whiteout thing so this is the Amazon basic whiteout strip thing like the whiteout tape I keep this for like because I use pen a lot I don't like pencil so you know you can't erase pen so I use this and I like fix any mistakes that I make this it says girl power and it's just like a little nail kit my nails like if you know when you break your nails I like when I break a nail and it just like sits there messed up I have to fix it or if I have a hangnail something I have to fix it so I keep uh I keep one of these in every single bag I have to make sure that like I'm getting my nails together you know and then I just have some Altoids just because you need a mint and I really like these. These also help if like you're getting real tired in class and you need something to wake you up. I like these and because I usually have a sweet tooth after I eat food. So instead of actually going to eat something that's sweet or getting like a dessert or something, you know, desserts here are not that good. But like I usually just go for one of these to like satisfy that sweet tooth instead of going to have something that's way worse for you. <laughs> that... Then I have these sour icebreakers. Serves the same purpose, you know. And then I have a whistle. I'll probably do a video on this, but I have two jobs here on campus. One of my jobs, I am an intramural ref for intramural sports. So I need my whistle. If I do not have my whistle, I cannot do my job. If I do not have my whistle, I think money comes out of our paycheck. So I always keep my whistle in my bag, whether I'm working or not. So I'm prepared. So. I have my whistle here and that's all I have in that section and then there's one more section in my bag y'all I know we thought we were done <laughs> but there's one more section in my bag it's this bottom section right here I do not use it now well I use it every now and then but I don't use I don't use it for like everyday stuff in my book bag but this section is really good it came in good handy when I was in high school as well and like when I have performances it's just like I'm not to explain it, but it's just like another extra storage <laughs> in the bag. And for this part, I usually would like put some shoes or something right here. Because you know your shoes, you step on like the dirty outside floor and all that. And UGA, go dogs. They love dogs here. So dogs are everywhere. You probably stepped in something that a dog pooped on recently or something. So you don't want like your shoes, if you, if you carry like two pairs of shoes or something, you don't want that inside your bag, so you keep your shoes in the bottom. So, that's that. There's nothing in it right now, but you know, that's what I usually use it for. And that is what I keep in my everyday college school book bag. Let me know what other video, whatever other videos you guys want to see from me. And I will make sure that I get those out for y'all. College has been, you know. So, most definitely just let me know if there are anything if there's anything that you guys want to know and I'll make those videos for you all. First year is almost over. Next year is gonna be a little bit different. So, you know, just let me know and I'll most definitely get those videos out for you guys. I know UGA is a really big school. College is a really big thing. So if you guys wanna know any information from me, whether it's like couple scholarships, your major, what classes to take, advising, anything, just let me know and I'll most definitely help you guys. So. I love you guys. If there's anything that you guys liked about what I keep in my butt bag or we keep the same type of stuff in our butt bags, just comment that down below. Comment anything 
that you want to down below and i most definitely look at it because i always look at the comments like this video if you like the video of course and share it with somebody who's going into college to help them like figure out what to keep in your bag what you need for every day because a lot of people keep a lot of extra stuff in their book bag that they do not need a lot of people don't bring everything in their book bag just in case so you know just make sure you share that with somebody and subscribe so you can see more videos and be notified when a new video comes out of mine because the new videos are coming and i love you guys so my name is sincerely Dre, and i will see you in the new video bye, bye.